Hi, Zach Klemp here with Sally Automotive, and I'm going to walk you through the web client in the manager's portal view of the Sally Automotive platform. And for those of you wondering what exactly Sally is, we're an easy to use, simple CRM and internet lead management platform built from the ground up for used car dealers. While a lot of technology in the automotive industry is built for new car dealers, Selly took a different approach focusing on the underserved used car dealer segment. That's why we offer a very affordable, easy to use platform that your dealer could get up and running on and manage your internet leads, customer follow-ups, send out text messages, and really give your dealership that new car dealer advantage at that used car dealer price point. So here I'm on the sales team page. I could see my uh, sales team. In this case, I only have one sales rep. I could see the live activity. If I click more info, I could see all of the different actions that Zach Klempf has had. I could also see the most recent stats on a daily, weekly, or monthly basis. In Selly, we make it very easy to add or delete sales reps at any time. If I were to delete a sales rep, I would reassign all of their data. So once they leave my dealership, all of that data would be secure still within our system. We also make it very easy to get started. We have tutorial videos throughout the platform. You could create a help ticket right from the Selly platform on the bottom right hand corner. And we also have put together a help center with tons of articles and many frequently asked questions to get your dealership set up right away. In addition to that, we have support available via phone and part of the onboard process will walk your dealership through the platform and make sure you're comfortable and set up for success. Let's move on to the client's module. You'll see the number two right there. That's because we have two untouched internet leads. That means these leads have not been responded to by the sales team or myself being the manager. Let's click on Charlie Brown and show you what a full filled out profile looks like. So I could see the current deal that Charlie Brown is on, a 2015 Honda Odyssey. I could toggle the different deal stages as well, right from this client info screen. I could search him on social media, Facebook or LinkedIn. I could send him an opt-in text message, or I could create a Selly voice call and log it in the system. And with Selly voice, this is an upsell we offer. You could actually call from the browser, or you could route it to your cell phone, or landline but we'll continue with the demo and you could learn more about the Selly voice functionality in another feature video so at the bottom I could see my documents whether that's proof of insurance copy of a driver's license the whole sales team could add clients or sorry client comments and a timestamp will appear as well as the user who added the comments you could also manage all the tasks associated with this customer, appointments, and vehicles and deals. Let's jump into vehicles and deals. Here I could see the vehicles of interest. I could see the deal we're working on. We also have a quick quote option. Basically what that is is a ballpark estimate of where they'd be on a cash deal or a finance. Again, we're not trying to take over a DMS functionality. We're just offering a quick quote if you want to just do a ballpark figure. And again, we also integrate with a lot of different DMS systems, Auto Manager, Wayne Reeves, Frazier, Skyworks, Surefire DMS, as well as many others. Let's move on to the client history. Here I could see the full paper trail between the sales rep and this client. I could also see calls logged as well as emails. And with the Selly voice functionality, you could also replay calls that are recorded. I could filter my client list by sales rep, date range, status in the system, source, as well as vehicle. Now let's move on to the inventory module. We'll get your inventory updated on a nightly basis from either your DMS, your dealer website, or your inventory management system. And I'll click on this 2013 Mercedes-Benz and show you what a vehicle profile looks like. Here I could see days on the lot, price point, I could share on social media. We have a market value tool powered by VinAudit to see where I'm priced within the market. 
In addition to that, I could pull up a Carfax or AutoCheck report or CarProof if I'm in Canada. And I could also email this vehicle to a customer. Appointments here, I can manage all the appointments for my dealership. I could add appointments for my sales reps as well. And I have that easy to use calendar to go backwards or forwards. We're going to skip over analytics and jump into the lead management part of our platform. I'm going to click on Kelly Lee and I'm going to show you what her profile looks like under the internet lead management section. Here I could see this lead has been touched by a sales rep. That's why it's white and not green. Green in Selly means untouched or unread. I could see that my sales rep has emailed them. I could see that they've logged a call, but an appointment and a deal is currently not in the works. Under my lead settings, I could set up auto assign rules, custom round robins, or I could even set it up where, for instance, my sales rep only handles a cars.com account. In addition to that, I could set up autoresponder email templates for each internet lead or just have one general template. I also have lead analytics under here. I could see which leads are closing the most or lead providers and where I'm getting the most return on investment from my internet lead spin. Let's move on to task management. Here I can manage all the tasks in my dealership similar to the appointment section. I could add tasks for my sales team. I could go back or forwards. For instance, I could go back to April and see what tasks were completed or incomplete. I have filter options here. I could see a live activity feed. That's every action that's going on in real time in Selly. And I could also go in task analytics and see with my sales reps or my sales team who's following up, who has incomplete tasks, who has upcoming tasks. We're going to move on to the work plan. This is a really important part of the platform. It allows you as the dealership manager to set the follow-up system for your whole store. So in the internet lead stage, I have a couple different follow-ups here. I could do email, I could do call, I could do a custom task like send out a text message for instance. We also allow you to do special event email blasts. So for instance, if I wanted to do a birthday blast, I could set that right up in the work plan. I could also set up different follow-ups and email blasts based on deal stages as well. Let's jump into email. We've actually redesigned email and we have some really cool stuff now. For instance, we give you the full inbox and the client inbox view. What that means is with the full inbox view, I'm going to see all of my emails. Client inbox, that's only for clients saved under the client section in Selly. And this allows a more filtered, easy to read view and gets out all of the noise like the spam and the different email newsletters or Facebook updates I might get in a full inbox view. If I click in the sent folder, I could also see whether emails I sent out are opened. And you could also set up desktop alerts for email opens as well. That's why you see this right up here. We could also add custom signature, email templates, and it's really easy to configure my email in Selly as well. And for email templates, one other thing I forgot to mention, we actually support HTML templates and plain text. Let's jump into text messaging. Here, I set up my compliant text messaging. If I want to send out an opt-in to a customer, for instance, I could just click one of the customers, set out an opt-in, and once they agree, I could start communicating with them. Here's an example of a customer not agreeing to an opt-in. Finally, I'm going to jump into the settings, show you a couple cool things. We're localized in 11 different languages. Again, we have tutorial videos throughout the platform. You could export data as a CSV file at any time. That's a manager-only privilege. Of course, your sales team couldn't do that, but if you have that manager role in the manager portal, you can. We also have web notification settings, so you could set up email open notifications, internet lead notifications, comment notifications, and a lot of other notifications to make sure you as the manager are aware of everything that's going on in the platform. Again, my name is Zach Klimt. 
Thank you for watching this video and this overview of the manager's portal of our web client and feel free to check out the other videos to give you a sense of what Selly offers.